Today's story is Celebrating the Fourth of July. This story is about a curious and imaginative boy named Will who loved exploring new worlds through the pages of books, and his favorite place to embark on these adventures was the cozy library in the heart of his small town. One sunny morning, Will put on his sneakers, grabbed his backpack, and set off on his bike to the library. As he pushed open the creaky wooden doors, the smell of old books and excitement filled the air. Will knew that today's visit would be extra special because it was close to the 4th of July, a day of celebration and fireworks. Mrs. Jenkins, the friendly librarian, greeted Will with a warm smile. Hello, Will. Oh, what exciting tales are you looking to discover today? Will's eyes sparkled as he replied. I want to learn all about the 4th of July, Mrs. Jenkins how people celebrate, and why it's so important. Mrs. Jenkins led Will to a shelf filled with books about history and festivities. Will picked up a colorful book titled Fireworks and Freedom, the story of Fourth of July. He found a cozy corner, nestled between bookshelves, and began his reading adventure. As Will turned the pages, he discovered that the Fourth of July was a special day when the people of the United States celebrated their independence. It commemorated the time when the country declared itself free from a faraway king. Will's imagination soared as he learned about the brave men and women who fought for their freedom. He saw pictures of the American flag waving proudly, parades marching through streets, and families gathering for barbecues and picnics. Inspired by the stories, Will decided to organize a small celebration of his own. He borrowed books from the library about crafts and decorations and gathered his friends in the backyard to create festive decorations and flags. They painted colorful banners, made paper lanterns, and crafted their very own Liberty Bell out of clay. On the afternoon of the 4th of July, the families of Will's neighborhood joined Will and his friends in the local park. The air was filled with laughter, the aroma of grilled hot dogs and the sound of excited chatter. Will stood proudly next to his homemade Liberty Bell, ready to share what he had learned. With a confident voice, Will spoke about the significance of the 4th of July. The crowd listened intently, their hearts filled with pride for their country and gratitude for the opportunities it provided. As the sun began to set, the night sky lit up with bursts of brilliant colors. The fireworks painted the darkness with shimmering lights, creating a mesmerizing display that filled everyone's hearts with joy. As the last firework faded into the night, Will, together with his friends and neighbors, had created a memory that would forever be cherished. Throughout the years, Will continued to visit the library, eager to explore new stories and knowledge. He understood that books had the power to ignite his imagination, teach him about the world, and connect him to the rich history of his country and the world. For Will, the library would forever be a place of discovery, where the magic of books and the spirit of the 4th of July would always live on. The end. And that is today's story, celebrating the 4th of July from Stories and Tales. Thank you for listening, and until next time from Stories and Tales, 